Welcome back everyone to Dear Mona. My name is Pandora and welcome back to chapter 10, Morning Sickness. Wonder what that means. Let's hop right in. I had no idea what to do. With everything going on, I f had forgotten my plans with Sean and never thought Mark would show up at my school. It seemed like everything was going to blow up in my face and I didn't deserve anything less. What am I doing here? What are you doing here? Pandora, can I talk to you for a minute? No, you can't. She and I have plans. Maybe you had plans, but not anymore. I need to talk to Pandora. Both of you, stop. Sean, can you give me a minute? I need to talk to Mark alone. Then we can leave. Yeah, fine. Whatever. Mark, what do you think you're doing here? You can't just show up at my school unannounced. Are you still seeing him? After what happened between us last night? Mark wants to know if I'm still seeing Sean. What should I say? Yes, I am. Of course I am. One night between us doesn't change anything. How could you say that? You can't just walk walks back into my life and expect me to drop everything for you. I haven't returned your messages for a reason. I need some time to think. I don't really trust you. I understand that, and I don't deserve your trust, but... I thought last night meant something to you. It meant everything to me. Last night did mean something to me, but you have to give me a chance to tell Sean the truth. He doesn't deserve to be lied to. Fine. Go with him and do whatever you have to do. But I'll be waiting for your text. This isn't over, Pandora. Pandora? What was Mark doing at the school? Wait a minute. Was Mark the real reason for the moodiness last night? To tell you the truth? Yes, he was. Wow. So you lied to me. Sean thinks I lied to him about my moodiness from last night. What do I say? Tell him the truth. I'm sorry, but I just couldn't tell you the truth. And the truth is, Mark's been on my mind lately. Wow. Well, at least you admit it. That was wrong, Pandora. I know. I'm sorry. Did something happen? Don't lie to me, Pandora. Should I tell Sean what ha about what happened between Mark and I? Ease into it. Well, there's something you have to understand. You're right when you said Mark completely broke my heart. And a girl with a broken heart doesn't always make the best decisions. I went to talk with him and I lost myself. I got lost in the memories and then... Yes, something happened. We slept together. I'm so sorry. Wow. I mean it, Sean. I'm so sorry. I've never done anything like this in my life. I mean, this year has been crazy for me. I was depressed for years, and all of a sudden you came in and everything changes. I never expected to see Mark again, and I like you, Sean. I do. That's why I wanted to be completely honest. I understand if you never want to see me again. I don't deserve you. Sean? Ain't you going to say anything? Honestly, I don't know what to say. I know how much Mark tore you up over the years, but... Man, Pandora, this hurts. I'm sorry. I never meant to hurt you. Yeah, well, it's a little late for that. Listen, I have some work to do. You can show yourself out. Well, well, well. I hope you're proud of yourself. Stacy. I heard everything. 
How dare you play my brother for a fool like that, especially with my prom date. Stacy, let me explain. Save it. I don't listen to liars. And you're a nasty little skank, Pandora Ray. Do what Sean says and show yourself out. Poor baby. I know what she did was wrong, but still, poor baby. Pandora! What on earth is wrong? I'm... I'm... Okay, baby. Take a deep breath. Whatever it is, it can't be that bad. It's awful, Mom. I'm a terrible person. And I don't know how to fix what I did. What did you do? It's a long story, but here goes. It all started with Sean. Ten minutes later. Oh, Pandora. Please don't be mad at me. Please don't judge me. I know what I did was awful, but everything just happened so fast. I'm not going to judge you. And I'm not mad at you. You're punishing yourself enough. I don't know what to do. Well, the most important thing is, you were honest with Sean. It takes a big person to admit their mistakes. I would know. You would? Yes, believe it or not. I've been in the same sim similar situation before. Mom has been in the same position as I am. Do I want to know more? Yes. You have? You never told me that about it. Sometimes it's hard for me to talk about. I had a high school sweetheart, you know. His name was Chad, and he was perfect. Chad, huh? Anyway, I loved him. I really did. But then a new boy arrived when we started our senior year. His name was Chuck. And man, did he make my heart race. Long story short, I gave up what I had for Ch Ch Chad to be with Chuck. And Chuck gave me up after a month. Oh, Mom, I'm so sorry. But what are you trying to tell me? To look at the big picture. I miss Chad every day. The key is Pandora. Don't give up real love for something that seems fun at the time. Anyways, I see this is, has you shook up. The good news is, I feel like taking some time off work. So how about we go on an impromptu vacation? A few days at our favorite seaside resort are just what you need. And I, I need their spa. It sounds like you have it all planned out, Mom. Maybe I do. I thought of taking you somewhere over the holidays. However, this seems like a better time. I'll arrange for your school leave. What do you say? Hmm. This sounds so tempting. A perfect getaway from all the drama? How about the vacation? I have no diamonds. That sounds wonderful, but I'm ready. really not in the mood. Are you sure? Yes. I would just ruin your vacation. It's best if I just stay in bed. Suit yourself. It's too bad, though. A co colleague can join me, but I'd love to have you go with me, Could if you could go with me. Maybe another time. Okay, sweetheart. Get some rest. Thanks, Mom. It took a I took a couple days off, but it wasn't enough. I decided I needed space. Space from both of them. So I could figure out what I wanted to do. Well, it's not like Sean tried to call me. I wasn't surprised, but it did hurt. Especially because I was considering constantly ignoring Mark's calls. That hurt, too. 
Once again, a dark cloud hung above me. Blair and Max couldn't help me. Not really. Stacy was either avoiding me or giving me the stink eye. I thought things couldn't get worse. Boy, was I wrong. One day, a few weeks later, it all came to a head. This time to face the music. I'm probably running to Stacy again. Well, in that case, I need to keep it together. Let's find something that will boost my self-esteem. I don't have any coins, but we'll look at the outfits. We'll just go like that. Again. <laughs> I guess this will do. I'm not a fa it's not a fashion show. Although it was I'd get booted off the runway. I just need to fix my hair and I'm ready to go. All set. Ugh, I could barely keep breakfast down. What's going on with me lately? Sean, it's good to see you. What are you doing here? I've missed you, Pandora. So much that I'm happy to see you even in those rags. Wow. Hey, you're the one who chose to wear this. Well, he has to have a point. I can do better. Go through my closet again? No. I don't have the diamonds. Never mind. I'll survive with this outfit. Anyway, I was hoping we could talk. I won't lie. You really, really hurt me. But I want to hear your side. See how we can fix this. Wow, I... Oh, Lord. Pandora, I can't take you nor my calls any longer. I miss you so much. Can we talk? Seriously? You again? Yes, me again. And I'm not going away. That's hard to believe. I heard you were away for three years. You don't know anything about Pandora and me. There is no Pandora on you. Both of you. Stop it, please. This has got has to stop, Pandora. Who's it gonna be? Him or me? Oh God, I think I'm gonna be sick. Uh-oh. An unexpected test. Lately you've been feeling sick. Is it stress or could it be something else? But we will figure that out in the next episode. So if you're liking this series, which I'm loving reading it, and y'all would make different choices. Who would you choose? Sean or Mark? I'm thinking leaning towards Sean. But I'm hoping y'all are enjoying it. If you are, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Hit that bell icon because I upload twice a day. And I'll see y'all in the next episode. If you're not afraid, open that box. Bye, guys.